Hey, hey, hello and homes here and welcome back to some more Lies of P boss guy. Today we are going to be taking on the Black Rabbit Brotherhood version 2. And in this version you're going to be fighting three of them in the beginning. And then the older brother somehow resurrects. I don't know how they did it, but comes back to life at the end. And I'll show you guys how to deal with that. Pretty much you want to kill one right off the bat as quickly as possible to try to focus one down. I chose to focus down the sister because she can do decay. They have like weapon buffs this time around, so you want to watch out for that. And since out of the three weapon buffs they got, the decay in my opinion is probably the worst one. That's why she's going down. And I was trying to get some backstabs there, but it didn't work out. Uh, they stagger really easy. They don't have much damage. The thing that they'll mess you up with is the status ailments. And there's three of them. They won't all engage you at the same time. They kind of leave like a, a bit of um, room for you for some reason. Um, but yeah, so you just focus one down. Use your weapon buffs or whatever. Focus one down. Preferably the sister, like I said, because of the decay. That can like mess with your HP and your weapon durability. And then next, try to even out the the damage distribution for the two of them. Um, try to get one HP like fairly low, but don't kill them because the moment you kill the second uh, sibling or whatever, the boss spawns, or rather the elder brother spawns. So you're gonna be doing a two v one, and the brother doesn't stun. So like, I mean, it doesn't stagger. When you hit them like these guys, like these guys, when you swing at them, see they, they flinch and everything like that. But the, the elder brother doesn't. That doesn't happen to him. So, um, yeah. And he hits like a truck, unlike these guys, which hit like I don't know. Hit like I, thanks for this for the save, I guess. <laughs> but he pulled me away. All right. But yeah, the spear user is probably the easiest to deal with, I think, because. It's attacks is super slow as long as you don't get caught up in like any walls or whatever or debris you can pretty much just get, you can just strafe behind them and get backstabs off of them. The rabbit brother yeah the one with the rapier it's fairly easy to get around him too but he, his attacks are kind of quick so if you don't manage to get around you might get nicked a few times. And overheat is probably the second most annoying one out of the three. And shock is probably well due to the way that you can just strafe around the, the spear user's attack. Um, I feel like it's, it's easy to avoid getting hit by its by its lightning damage. All right, both of them are about to die here. I did get hit by shock again, which is unfortunate. Um, yeah, maybe bring some curatives. <laughs> So we got the kill there, and this guy's sharpening his weapon. Hello. Yeah. Alright, there's the brother. Let's let him scream. Let's get a few cheap shots in. Even though the HP is not displaying, I. Look, we already did damage, so make sure you hit him, even if he's like, you know, he's trying to draw his freaking Buster Sword over there. Alright, and it's more or less the same. This fight's bait him. He does the combo here. Let's make sure you don't get hit. After the red attack, you're free to get one or two shots in, maybe three hits, and then help it push to the fourth there to get away. Red attack, uh, we could have gotten some hits then there. Spin attack after this, you can go in for a hit, I use my legion arm. Rushing attack, be careful because he has a regular rushing attack which he just sweeps at the end there. You can dodge it by just rolling diagonal left towards him, or diagonal right towards him, or just straight up dodging right side. Doing this combo attack, let's be careful here. And charging up a red attack, get away, going for one hit, back away. Combo attack, just keep away. Falls in with the red attack, going for a hit or two. Ran out of stamina, let's back up. <laughs> uh, this move right here, if you're behind a debris, it can just straight up miss you, but. If he does it out of nowhere and there's no debris, uh, you can use your dodging iframe to dodge through it. So yeah, like what I did in the beginning, when the 
older brother showed up. I think I didn't have any debris near me, so I just used the iframe. I think I dodged backwards, and since I feel like the invincibility frame is pretty high in this game, it it just straight up dodged. I you might be able to dodge through it as well, but uh, the safe, like the sure way to avoid that completely, it's you go behind one of the, the one of the obstacles over here. There's like three of them in the arena, so. Yeah, it still has this like triple followed in by the fourth red uh, slash attack. So after the, I mean slash attack, the overhead attack. So after the overhead, we need to get some damage in. Just like right now, good. Get some damage in. Woo, almost got me. Alright, playing it really careful here because... I mean, baiting all these attacks, unless you're like a parry master. Which I know some people out there is. I'm not. I <laughs> freaking suck at parrying in this game. So yeah, we're just baiting its attacks and then getting a few hits in and then just back away. Pretty much a hit and run, <laughs> hit and run tactic here. Um, it's the way to go in my opinion. And I'm playing it safe here because the fight is fairly long. I don't want to. If you die and then you come back in, you have to fight the three siblings again and then this guy shows up at the end, so I don't know, it gets pretty tedious if you repeat this a few times. There's this smoke wave thing. <laughs> oh god. Alright, slashing tag, going for a heavy, back away, combo attack, just keep away from that. And dodge. Okay, that was some decent damage. Rushing attack. So you can just avoid the uh, dodge to the side to avoid that. Pretty sure you can dodge diagonal right towards him to kind of like make a miss as well. Just like in the first fight when you, when, when you fought him out in the lane. And see ya! <laughs> and stay dead this time, goddammit. And yeah, Black Rabbit Brotherhood, round two, done. And as always, here are my setups. This is gonna be my weapon, my Legion arm, my amulets, and the defense parts are still the the default versions and here's the grindstorm using the fire one which you can get really earlier on and here are my stats and level for this fight and here's my p organ setups And yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for this video, so I thank you all so very much for watching. Hopefully this video has helped uh, if you're struggling against the boss, and if it did, hopefully you all will stay tuned for more. But until next time, hope to catch y'all later. Ohms. Oops.